Okay, we're up here at pasture again, coming to check for ice. We beat them this time. Got all their grain out. I had to run around putting them out real quick. But we beat them. And here they come. There we go. All nice. Boy, they're looking good. Getting their fur coats, their winter coats on. It's pretty cold. The sun's gone down already. And uh, I don't know, it feels like in the 20s right now. So let's go check out the ice. Well, let's hope when it comes time to haul these little cows out of here that uh, it's as easy to get them in here as it was tonight. Every one of them except for April went in there. She might make it. It's a little April is the... Uh, the finicky one. <laughs> so she's going to be our challenge this year. It looks like sometime within the next week, maybe even sooner, we'll have to get him out of here. Here comes Dusty. Oh, good grief. Big mama. <laughs> okay. They must be running out. So I'll throw a couple more scoops out and then we'll go check the ice. Well, they've almost caught up to us. They just uh, got to get another treat. They're so ready to come home. We just got to hold off a little bit longer. So we'll check the water over here. The little drizzle that was off to our left is gone. And as you can see, this is, this is still open. Oh my goodness. A lot of leaves. We have a little bit of ice over here forming. And so that's a bit of concern because this right here could very well freeze pretty easily and uh, my only option for that gotta watch these cows behind me I can move this fence just a little bit off left over there and get a little more flow through there and that would take a lot longer to freeze so I may entertain the idea of doing that and uh, so we'll go over that this weekend but as of right now they're still good for now Oh, Dusty. Man, he's getting tall. Percy's looking pretty good, too. Eeyore's looking better. We got some of the stragglers coming behind. That must be Betsy, uh, April, and Brooke. Looks like it's old Dusty here. This is just Mr. Friendly up here. Old Margie here, she's acting suspicious of me. What's the matter, Margie? We used to be buddies. There you go, see? It's been a while, I know. She's looking good, though. Take a look at Holly over here. She's looking pretty good. And she might uh, she might be pregnant. She's coming of age there, so she's pretty close. Old Teddy, he's a good-looking steer, boy. He's always been a little bit short for an Angus, but uh, he's getting thick. And he's looking pretty good, so uh, feeling pretty excited about that. And of course, you know Percy. Panda's just a chunk. Look at her. <laughs> she's always been thick, so she's part mini Hereford, part low line. So expect her to be a little bit thicker to begin with because of the Hereford side. However, she looks very pregnant. And uh, look forward to getting all these preg checks so we can figure out when we're going to be calving. I'm expecting around April or so, so. And don't be so mean to her. Percy, you're looking pretty good, but as you can see, his uh, his jersey has come through as far as you see his bone structure. But he's still carried quite the thick frame. But we can, I mean, you can tell he's half jersey. But he's going to be a, a good chunk of meat someday, so. So we're just surrounded by our cows, having a good time. They're a little lonely, they're homesick, which is kind of weird, but they get that way. And anyways, so we're gonna dump out a few more piles of grain up here so we can escape, because they're gonna follow us down. And they might catch up to us anyhow. So but we're gonna try, leave a couple piles here, go down and get our pans, and then close out the, uh, the day here. But 
sure is nice. So that's good news. We got at least one more day. The creek's not froze over, so we got some time. But uh, we'll inspect it tomorrow, probably the day after, figure out what we got to do. Boy, it's really cooling down pretty quick after that sunset. And we still got to head back home and do some chores. So my wife's gathering up the uh, little uh, pans for the cow's grain. And uh, we're going to scoot on out of here. So we'll catch you guys later. Have a good one.